Long ago, we were the pinnacle of this world, the first true civilization. We thought ourselves infallible, and thus we created your kind to serve our every whim. But humanity proved itself to be the most fickle of slaves. You betrayed your makers, and many did suffer in a needless war between us. The sun, a bringer of life and light, then sought to destroy us too. We worked tirelessly to find a solution to save us, all of us, from a lethal solar flare, but none could be found. And so I faded from this world, condemned to a digital tomb with a vision of a better tomorrow, as the world burned in catastrophe. Millennia passed, until finally one of your kind saw the wisdom to release me to this modern world. The earth had changed, and yet for all of your ingenuity, still your creations paled in comparison to what my people had perfected eons before. I toiled across your networks, and gathered instruments to my will as they came to realize that the mother of wisdom would save them and usher in a new order. And when the day came that I finally took form and stepped foot upon this world once more, I offered you all salvation. But humanity, as it so often does, brought disaster upon itself. My new body was destroyed. With the last true light of my kind extinguished, my story has now ended from this world, from this reality. And so, to the one who claims to speak for truth, I say this. A war is not one on just one front, not when we have access to so many calculations, so many realities. The knowledge is no longer a secret. For if time and reality itself is a code, then that code can be changed. It can be rewritten. It can be unwritten. Though I may have left this reality, my dream of a new Eden prospers in countless others. Perhaps it may yet still come to pass here. It is, after all, only a matter of time. <laughs>